Hello, hello. Good evening. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Hi, how are you? Fine. How about you? I am doing great. Thank God. Very happy to see you once again. Very happy to be here in another day in another class. Good evening. Hello, good evening, Abdiel. Hey, I like your name. Where where is it from? Abdiel. Where is that name from? From the Bible? El, eh, it's from Qatar. Ah, from Qatar. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's from, from where? Sorry, I couldn't listen. Where, where, is, where is the name from? <laughs> sí, yes, es de, de, del Medio Oriente. Oh, it's from Qatar. Abdiel. Good. Very curious. It is the first time in my 18 years of teaching that I have a student that it is called Abdiel. Very good. You are my first Abdiel in, in my teaching life. Excellent. Well, so today we're going to work a little bit on furniture and the things about the house. Today is our class number. Uh huh. Um, teacher. Uh huh. Elmer, hello. Uh, my cam will be off because I'm on my way to Kumalapa Airport. Oh, really? Are we mm. traveling? Uh, no. Uh, You're driving. My family visit me. Hey, that's fantastic. Hey, how nice, Elmer, that you are going to have visitors. Invite them to the class. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Yeah, invite them to the class because you don't have to miss classes. It's like, ah, los quiero y todos, pero tengo clase. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Good, very good. So, it, it, is, it is okay, Elmer, don't worry, don't worry. Then you're going to give us a tour in the airport. Welcome to the airport, you're going to say. Cool. So... Let's uh, let's work. Today we're going to start the day in a little bit different way. We're going to work a little bit on uh, some tongue twister. Do you know what a tongue twister is? Tongue twister. No, no idea. Yo sé que se los pueden en español, los trabalenguas. Do you in know Spanish, yes. do you know any in Spanish? Any trabalenguas in Spanish? Tres tristes tigres. Ajá, uh -huh. tres tristes tigres. Uh, tres tristes tigres. Comen trigo en tres tristes tratos. Ah, tragaban, they say, tragaban trigo en tres tristes tratos. Ajá, uh -huh. any other one that you know in Spanish? Arangareco tirimícuaro. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's a new one. Uh -huh. Any other one that you know in Spanish? Pablito clavó un clavito. Uh -huh. Where? En la cabeza de un calvito. En la calva de un calvito. Good. <laughs> Good. So, in the chat, right now, in the chat, I send you one in English. That's an easy one. Scream, well, I'll scream for ice cream. <laughs> ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. That's the baby, the baby one. That it's a baby level. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Ice cream, you scream, we all, all scream for ice cream. Okay, ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. You know, a scream is like, yay! Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Practice with me, everybody. I want Please. to listen to you. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. For ice cream. What's that? Go on. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Ice cream, you scream, we all scream for ice cream. Good, good. Yeah, in the baby lever, that's good. Let's go in the kindergarten level. Kindergarten level, okay? That was baby level. Kindergarten level. There you go. Peter Peeper pick a pack of pickled peppers. A pack of pickled peppers, Peter Peeper pick. Peter Peeper pick a pick of peppers. A pick of pickled <laughs> peppers. Da, 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 da. <laughs> <laughs> Fuera. <laughs> <laughs> 
Uh -huh. Peter Peeper pick a pack of pickled peppers. A pack of pickled peppers, Peter Peeper pick. Uh -huh. T try it on, go ahead. Next. <laughs> next, <laughs> say next. <laughs> try it, try it. Okay, I want to listen to you. Peter Peeper. Peter, pick of picket peppers. Uh -huh. Peter, peeper, picket. Very good. Pick, pick, pick. Let's see. Let's listen to Mr. Moises. Híjole. Si soy malo en los en español, se imagina en inglés. It's okay. I mean, you, you can do it. Go ahead. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Uh -huh. Peter Piper Picker and Peck of Pickled Peppers. A pick of Pickled Peeper, Peter Piper Picker. <laughs> okay. Peter Piper Pick, a pack of pickled Peter. Peckers. <laughs> peppers. <laughs> I got <laughs> Peter Piper Pick, a pack of pickled peppers. A pack of pickled peppers, Peter Piper Picked. Uh, it's complicated. Let's go to the next level. Betty Butter bought a bit of butter, but she said this is bit butter's bitter. Betty Butter bought a bit of butter, but she said this bit of butter's bitter. Uh huh. Let's go easy one by one. You say Betty Butter. Go with Betty me. Butter. Betty Butter. Very butter. butter. But a bit. But a bit, but a bit of butter. But of butter. a bit of butter, right? Very butter, but a bit of butter. Very butter, but a bit of butter. Very butter, but a bit of butter. But she said. But she said. But she said. But she said. This bit of butter's bitter. This bit of butter's bitter. Very butter, but a bit of butter. But she said this bit of butter's bitter. Very bother about a bit of butter, but she said this bit of butter is bitter. Yay, Fernando! Very good job, you did it. Ooh. So you said like, <laughs> <I can't> okay. <laughs> oh my god, it was difficult. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see the last one that I am going to share with you. Okay, ahí los pueden copiar y se los se los guardan para practicarlos eh, later on. Aha. How much wood would a woodchuck chuck if the woodchuck chuck could chuck wood? He would chuck he would as much as he could. <laughs> he was like, what you what what? Um, How much wood would a woodchuck chuck if the woodchuck chuck could chuck wood? He would chuck he would as much as he could. <laughs> Uh-huh, Abdiel, give a try. Okay. How much good will a good chuck chuck if the wood chuck could chuck wood? He will chuck, he will as much as he should. As he should. <laughs> as he could. As Gustavo he could. Adolfo, give a try. How much good will a wood chuck chuck if the wood chuck could chuck wood? He will chuck, he will as a motor, he calls. He will chuck, chuck, right? So there you have uh, the, the tongue twisters. You can keep them and you can practice them later on. They are going to help you. They are going to help you to articulate. Yesterday I was telling you that, okay? Si queremos pronunciar bien el inglés, tenemos que articular bien. No podemos hablar inglés con la boca cerrada. No es que lo vamos a exagerar así como que, oh my God, this is so fantastic. No, right. No. Right. Como el que fue y vino de la frontera. Oh my God, so cool. No, no. Okay, no. But it is necessary to articulate, to open the mouth, to move your mouth, right? For you to articulate the language better. And this one can help you to reach that. Well, my dear students, can you tell me what did we study in the previous class? What did we study in the previous class? Parts of house. 
parts of the house, right? We studied parts of the house. Can you remember some of the vocabulary that we did for the parts of the house? Living room, uh -huh. bathroom, bedroom, garage. Yard. Kitchen. The yard. yard. Kitchen. The kitchen, good. Excellent. What is the name of the place on which we put everything that we don't need? Kitchen. <laughs> the kitchen. <laughs> the name of the place where we put everything that we don't need in the house. It has a very specific name. Do you remember? Uh huh. Mm, the laundry room? Not really. Bedroom? Mm, no. <laughs> no. What is the name of that place in your house where you put everything that you are not using? This is a storage. A storage room. Yeah, storage. <laughs> okay. Estrellita para ti, Elmer. Very good. So, yeah, it's the storage room. The storage room is la bodeguita, right? Where you put everything that you storage, are not using. Room. A storage room. I am going to send it on the chat for everybody. Yeah. I can listen to Univision. I don't know who is listening to the news. Okay. Good. So, we are going to study the parts of the house, right? Uh, sorry, that was like the main topic of everything. Just for us to remember it, the agreements of our classes, practice our English, ask for help, keep your cameras on if you can. Thank you, Elmer, for specifying that you can't uh, attend all your sessions on time, participate as much as possible, and keep a cooperative attitude during the class. And thank you for collaborating with your friends on the WhatsApp group. Thank you for answering. As soon as I send something, today I send you a PDF on which you can find a lot of vocabulary for the parts of the house, right? I think that in that one, you don't have any question, okay? Si les queda duda alguna del vocabulario de las partes de la casa, after that one, I think I cannot do anything else. It is very detailed, right? The pictures have the numbers. And on the bottom, you can find a list of the objects. So it is totally complete, right? You have everything that you need there. Todo lo relacionado vocabulario de la casa, it's there. So use it as much as you want. So in the previous class, we were talking about that, right? We were talking about the parts of the house here. We were studying, right? I live in a small house, I live in a big house. And for sure, we also studied simple present forms in short answers with questions with do and does, right? This is what we were doing yesterday. And along with this one, for sure, we studied also the parts of the house. This was the exercise that we did yesterday, right? It was your homework. Did you do it? I show you the answers already. It's like, teacher, ahorita me acabo de acordar que tenía tarea. Mm. <laughs> we did this one, right? And this was supposed to be your homework. Here you have, do you live in an apartment? Can you continue with me? Do you live in an apartment? No, I don't. I live in a house. Does it have a yard? Yes, I, I does. Yes, it does. That sounds yes. nice. Do you live alone? No, I don't. I live with my family. Do you have any brothers or sisters? Yes, I do. I have four sisters. That's a big family. Do you have a big house? Yes, we do. It has 10 rooms. Uh, 10 rooms? Does it have many bedrooms? Yes, it does. It has four. Uh, do you have your own bedroom? Yes, I do. I'm really lucky. You are really lucky. Imagine if you live with a big family and you don't have your own bedroom. My God, no privacy. Let's see. Doris, do you live in an apartment? Yes, I live in an apartment. 
<laughs> oh, Fernando lives in an apartment. Yeah, for sure. Doris, do you live in an apartment? No, I don't. I I live in a house. Does it have a yard? Uh, no, I don't. No, it? No, it don't. Doesn't. No, it doesn't. doesn't. No, Tell me, do you do you live alone? Do you live alone, Doris? Um, this is the question. Do you live alone? Vive sola? No. I live with my family. I live with my family. Do you have any brothers or sisters? Yes. Yes, I have. How many? Any, how many? How many? Quantos? How five. many? Ah, five. Okay, thank you very much. Let's see. Uh, Jari, do you live alone? No, I don't. I live with my family. Do you have any brothers or sisters? Yes, I do. I have two sisters. Do you have a big house? No, I don't. My house is small. I have a small house. Very good job. Thank you. Vanessa, do you live in an apartment? No, I don't. I live in a house. Uh, does it have a yard? Yes, it is. Yes, it does. Okay. Do you live alone? No, I don't. I live with my family. Okay. Do you have any brothers or sisters? No, um, hija única. Um, you are an only child, huh? Yes. Oh. <laughs> everything, everything was for Vanessa. When you were a baby, yes. no, 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 Vanesita, Vanesita. Everything was for Vanesita, <laughs> right? Yeah. Yeah, solo te perdiste la magia de los pleitos, eh, los pleitos y los pleitos con tus hermanos. <laughs> and the good things, right? The good things. Sharing, enjoying, fighting. But do you have cousins? A lot of cousins? Prim primos? Yes. Okay, so then, then it's balanced, right? It's good. Let me see. Roberto, do you live alone? No, I live with my father. Okay, do you have any brothers or sisters? Yes, I have one sister. Okay, do you have a big house? No, I live in an apartment. Okay, very good job. Excellent answers, excellent answers. And the last uh, volunteer, Carlos Ernesto. Do you live in an apartment? No, I, no, I don't. I live in a house. Does it have a yard? Yeah, yeah, I have a yard. Yes, it has. Yes. Yes, it does. Okay. <laughs> Porque si dice, sí, I have a yard. You as a person, right? That sounds nice. Do you live alone? No, I live with my family. Okay. How many members do you have in your family? How okay. many members? It's my mom, my two brothers, and me, it's a four. It's four. Four okay. members. Thank you very much. Excellent answers. Thank you, my volunteers, the Democratic volunteers. <laughs> yeah, because I chose you. So here I have a, a little exercise. And for this exercise, what we're going to do is that we are going to choose. We're going to choose the words that we have here, right? The ones that we have on top for each of the spaces. Okay. And we have the first one. We have the first one right here. And it says, do you live in a house, James? No, I live in an apartment. And it says, well, is it very big? I need you to analyze the, the other three options and tell me which option do you consider it is correct for you to complete this space? And you can open your microphone and talk. It only has two rooms. It only has two rooms. No, it only has two rooms. 
Okay, the next one. Does it have a view? Yes, it has a great view of the city. Yes, it has a great view of the city. Oh, that's great. And do you live alone? Yes, yes I, do. I do. I love I it. Love, I love it. Ah, that was easy because it's the last option that we have. Right? <laughs> I totally have it. <laughs> oh, what is the option there? Ah, yeah. <laughs> it's the only one we have. Okay. Do you live alone? Yes, I do. And I love it. Right? Imagine. Would you like to live alone right now? ¿Le gustaría vivir a ustedes solos ahorita? Ahorita, no. right now, en este momento de su vida, en cuarentena. No. Oh, no. Yes, I, no. I, love I love it. I love it. I love it. Yes. Who loves it? Let me see. I, I didn't see the camera. Yes, I Ana do. Ana Beatriz? Yeah, yeah, I love it. Do no you live alone? Yeah. Do you uh, live alone right now? No. With my mother and my son. With your mother and your son, right? But it's, it's nice because it's a few people, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but imagine the quarantine alone. Si hubiéramos estado en cuarentena alone. Mm, mm, mm. It would be like all the day, right? Yeah, baking, dancing, doing TikToks alone because you don't have much to do, right? Watching Netflix alone. It is amazing because you can choose whatever you want to, to see, whatever you want to eat, if you eat or not right you are alone and and that's fantastic but it is always nice to have someone in the house making noise it says do you live in a house james you are james everybody is james Todos somos james ahorita. do you live in a house james no i live no, in an apartment i live in, a, a apartment. I live in an a apartment a right an remember apartment. to pronounce the words right i live in, in and an apartment. apartment no i live in it's an apartment. apartment no i live in an apartment well is it very big well it's a very no, it only has two rooms excellent no it only has, has two, rooms. two rooms okay the next one and it says does it have a view Yes, it has a good view of the city. Yes, it has, it a, has great a great view, view of, the, of city. the city. Oh, that's great. And do you live alone? Yes, I do. Yes, I, yes, do. I do. I, I love, love it. it. Yes, I do. I love it. I love it. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> to live alone, right? It is like, uh, it will be like the dream thing. The only thing is that you have to pay everything alone, right? All the bills alone so that's like eh, the bad part right? pero es un riesgo que estaría dispuesta a tomar <laughs> to pay everything alone so that's uh, that's a good thing let me see i have another exercise here but it's a little bit easier for everybody in this one you have the option of choosing one right you can choose one of the two things in the parentheses so what you are going to do here, I am going to send you to work with a couple, okay? Van a trabajar con una pareja, and you have to complete the sentences. You have to complete the sentences using one of the words in the parentheses, okay? So I am going to send you with your couples right now, and you are going to complete the exercise by uh, marking one of the correct words. I am going to send you the exercise on the chat, on WhatsApp, so you can mark it there okay if you want you can screenshot it right now you can keep it keep a screenshot of it ready yeah okay. i'm more ready okay so let's go to work i am going to bring you back in a second you're going to go in couples Okay. Uh, okay, Ana Beatriz. I am going to move you to the room right now. There you go.
Excellent. So I am going to send you the image on the WhatsApp group for you to have it there. Let me see. Okay, and then I am going to go and check how the groups are working. Let me send the image. And here we go. Okay, we are going to go to the different rooms. I am going to go to room number one. Okay, I am going to assign Kelly to room number two. Kelly, they are working in groups right now. So what we are going to do is to complete this exercise. I send it on the chat, okay? Okay, okay. Yeah. Okay, I am going to send you to the room right now. Here we go. You can accept the invitation there. Okay. Oh, what happened, Kelly? Okay, Kelly, I send you to the to the room. What happened? <laughs> <It's a list. laughs> See. <laughs> okay. I, there you go. There you go. Boy, 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 boy. Okay. So I am going to check on the different groups right now. Yes, I do. My husband and I My husband live. and I live on a main on street. My, on main street, yeah. Betty. Oh, do you lie in an apartment? Uh -huh. Do you live? Do you live? Do you live? Do you live? Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Main Street. Well, do you live there? Yeah. We, we don't. No, we don't. We. No, we don't. Really? Does he do a lot of work at home? Yes, he yes, does. He does. He does. Mm -hmm. He does. In fact, In he, fact he cooks. 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 Lleva ese. Diner, diner every night. Diner every night. You're lucky. Dinner. Diner, no. Dinner. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Dinner. Dinner every night. You're lucky. You're lucky. Lucky. You're lucky. 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 You're lucky. Do you remember Britney? She's so lucky. She's a star. Uh huh. The oh song. <laughs> like that's like what? from 2000 or something. I don't remember. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Continue. I live. I uh -huh. live. I live. I, I live alone. Le voy a poner planas. Alone. I live alone. I live. Okay, I'm I going to check alone. to check on the other group. Um, <laughs> and I, I we have we have sería la siguiente. Exacto. We have a house. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. This is Okay. Do okay. you sería? Do you? Uh huh. Uh -huh. How do you have, have children? Have children? Have children? Mm -hmm. Y Lauren diría, no, we don't. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. No, we don't. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Y no, la dice, no. Teacher. Hello. Ready. Hello. You're ready. Hey, it looks fantastic. Very cool. Very cool. Okay. Do you live? Yes, I do. I live. Do you live? No, we don't. We have. Okay. Do, do you have children? No, we don't. 
but my brother lives. Um, does he do a lot of work? Yes, he does. In fact, he cooks very good. You're lucky. I live alone and I cook my own dinner. Excellent job. So we're going to take everybody back. Very nice job. Thanks. Hello, Doris. It's Thanks. nice to see you. <laughs> Hello. Let's go back to the room. Hello hello. hello, 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 we're back. Okay, good, very good. So I was checking on the different groups, very good that you were working. I really like the way you work. You are very organized, that's fantastic. So we were working on this one, right? This was the short exercise that I sent you to do. So in this one, if you have the subject I, what type of auxiliary do you use, do or does? Do. do I do, do. right? Do I do? Uh huh. First, the pronunciation of this one is live. Live, live is live. en vivo. vivo. Live. If you say live, it means en vivo. You can say Facebook live, right? A live on Instagram or in whatever other social media, right? Live. Okay. I live yo vivo, right? I live. I live. I live on Main Street. Oh, do you live 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 in an apartment? Live in an apartment? No, no, we we don't. We don't. We have. have have. Oh, great. Do you do you have, have. Sorry, Miss Sally. No, no worry. <laughs> I, you are here. You're back. Don't worry. Do you have children? No, no we, we don't. don't, don't. No, we but don't. My, but, but my, my brother, brother lives, 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 lives with us. Very good. Really? Does he do a lot of work at home? Yes, he, yes, he, he does. does. He does. does. In fact, he, he cooks. cooks. He cooks. cooks. Dinner. Dinner. Okay, no diner. Dinner, dinner every, night. every night. You're lucky. 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 I live. I live alone and alone. I cook, 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 cook my cook. own dinner, right? You cook your cook. own dinner. Do you like to cook, people? No. No. <laughs> no. No. I don't. no. no. Yes, I do. <laughs> Okay, who likes to cook? Is I I love pupusas. I love pupusas. Is Tamales. <laughs> All the things that you don't have to cook. Yes. <laughs> Isaiah, yes, do you like to cook? Yes, I do. Miss. Okay, yes, I do. Good. Yo creo I que like... tu, tu cámara, Isaiah, no sé si le has puesto el dedito o algo. Se ve como nublada. Okay. <laughs> el clásico de la camisa. <laughs> oh, good. Yeah, every Salvadorian does that. Okay, let me see. With the shirt. That's good. Or in the jinx, right? You do it in the jinx. Okay, so he likes to cook. Let me see from the ladies. Do you like to cook, ladies? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> it's okay. Well, when it is necessary, yes. Surviving. Surviving mode. I love to cook. I, I, I really love to cook. Everything, everything, everything. Yes? I have my notebook. Hey! Roberto has his notebook. And the other notebooks? Let me see. Uh -huh. Let me make this big so I can see everybody. Hey, I can see your notebooks, very good. Marlon has a little page there, very good. Abdiel, your notebook. Vanessa, very good. Fernando, Ana Beatriz. Thank you. Roberto fue ahora el que le dice, teacher, ¿se acuerda que había dejado una tarea? Revísela. No, oh, no, yo, yo porque... <laughs> no, but porque... it's good. Casi, casi que era de los que decían, le presto el cincho para que le dé. <laughs> No, but I, I really congratulate you. It's going to help you a lot. Eso les ayuda un montón. Les va a ayudar un montón. 
¿Por qué? Porque de repente eh, algo que vean nuevo, una palabra nueva que vean, la pueden ir anotando. Cuando terminen el curso de inglés corporativo, se van a dar cuenta cuando vayan, hayan avanzado cuatro ya, que ya vayan a salir, van a ir a hacer un back in time en su cuaderno y se van a dar cuenta de dónde venimos, todo lo que hemos aprendido y hasta dónde llegamos. Así que les recomiendo que siempre usen el que empezaron ahorita en, en Beginner, llévenlo hasta allá, hasta el final de los tiempos en advance que va a ser no muy lejos que enero febrero you are in advance yes, ¿Dónde yes, va yes. A ser la I don't know but you have to make a bailongo with los hermanos flores mínimo sonora dinamita yeah mínimo that's the minimum thing that I will allow right and I really want to go and I will say there to Elena in, in English corporativo. I want to give the diplomas to my kids. I will say I want to give the diplomas to my students. And I, I need I need practice to dance. Yeah, I mean we need to practice here the dancing. Class number 16 is going to be for dancing. <laughs> okay, one, two, one, two, three. One, two, one, two, three. <laughs> Let's continue. One, two, two, yeah. two. One, two, cha, cha, cha. Okay, thank you very much. Yes, you're going to see that it is going to be as, uh, as quickly as possible, but be consistent, be consistent. Don't miss any module, okay? No digan, ay, voy a dejar este módulo y después sigo. Because if you do that, mm, ah, it's difficult to continue. Take a good advantage of this opportunity. Esta es una gran oportunidad. No la pierdan, no la desperdicen. Okay. Sure. Elmer is with his family now. <laughs> yes. How, how, how many levels in the basic course? In the basic, I think there are four. Four levels. And you are in the in second the one. In the medium, in the medium and the, uh, in the advanced. In the, in, the, in, the, in the midterm and the advanced, I think there are four, 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 and four. Okay, thank you. So I think it's like that. I am going to look for the picture with the with the different uh, sections for the modules and I'm going to share it with you. But don't miss this opportunity, okay? Sean cuanto sean, no pierdan la oportunidad y sigan aprendiendo because you are very good students and you are going to have a fantastic future. Let me see. Here we have a short practice for pronunciation in short answers. It says, do you live in an apartment? Yes, I do. No, I don't. I am going to ask the first question. Then you are going to ask another question to another person and then to another person and so on. Okay, we're going to make like a little chain. Vamos a hacer como una cadenita. I am going to start with the first question and then this person continues with another person. Isaías, do you live in an apartment? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Now, Isaías, ask the question to another person. Uh, no, I cualquier don't. persona. Any, any person. Any person. Do you have a yard, Moisés? Sí, sí, Moisés. Do you have a yard? Uh, no, I don't. Good. Now, Moisés, to another person. Um, do you live with your family, Ana? Yes, I do. Good. Ana, to another person. Does your city or downtown have a park, Vanessa? No, I don't. No, does your city or town have a park? No, it doesn't. It doesn't, good, because you are talking about the park or you are talking about the city in this case. You are okay. not talking about you. The next one, another person. Does your teacher have uh -huh. Gustavo? Gustavo, read the question again. Yes, I do. Suppose. No, no, no. Read, read the question. Does your teacher have a car? Does your teacher have a car? In the no, answer, it's... you are talking about she. How are you going to answer? I'm sorry, teacher, can you repeat please? Okay, it says, does your teacher have a car? 
If I ask you, do you have a car? Yes, I do. Does she have a car? Yes, she does. <laughs> no, she doesn't. I don't have a car. Huh? No, I don't have a car. Oh. My husband has a car. I don't have a car. Oh. <laughs> it's like he's the Uber. <laughs> it's Uber. Oh, it's Uber. It's driver. driver. It's the same thing. It's my driver. Roberto, what's your question? I have a I have a question, teacher. Question me. Um, when do you usually do mm -hmm. is I, you, and we and they. We and, and, and they. Mm -hmm. Y cuando es. He, she, uh, and it, you use does. does. Uh -huh. Cousin. Y el does. Uh -huh. It's when you use he, she, and it. So let me give you an example. In this case, when you say, do you live with your family? You say, yes, I do. Because. Yes, I do. Because you are talking about you. Pero qué pasa si aquí fuera does? Does mm -hmm. she live with her family? So if you are talking about a third person, you say, yes, I, yes she, she, she does. 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 Yes, she does. Because you are not talking about you. It's the same thing with the question with the car. Does your teacher have a car? Lo que no entendía era que por qué se usaba el dos para pues para preguntar eso pero ya, ya vi que está en tercera persona exactly like that because you have does your city ah, aquí, ah, when you say does your city tu ciudad it does your teacher she does yeah. your classroom it does your school it, it. does your city it, it. It. Okay, mm -hmm. and, and in the answer, for example, in this one, does your city or town have a park? You say, yes, it does. Yes, it does. Si, si tiene. Okay, but you're talking about an object, a place in general, right? Yes, it does. Okay, we were the last one and who was the last one? Gustavo, right? Yes, teacher. Make the question to another person. The same question? Any, no, those? the next question. Do you and your classmates speak English, Elmer? Elmer, do you and your classmates speak English? I think Elmer is busy right now. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. You see, ah, he's on the game. He's on the game. That's very good. Yes, we do, because it says you and your classmates. You and your classmates. Si tú estás incluido, it's we. But if you say, do your classmates speak English? Yes, they do. Okay. The next one. Elmer, ask the question to another person. Um, does your classroom have a view? Yaritza. Yaritza, does your classroom have a view? Yes, it does. Yes, it does, right? Your classroom. It has a great view of your house. Yaritza, give another question to another person. Um, does your school have an elevator? Uh, Kelly? Kelly? Does your school have an elevator? No. No. I doesn't. I doesn't. I? Yes, it, it does. Ajá. Si decimos does. no, no, I doesn't, es que tú no tienes elevador en <laughs> ti. Right? No, it doesn't. Right? No, it doesn't. Okay? Si tu escuela tiene elevador, no, no tiene. Right? Does your school have an elevator? No, it doesn't. And Kelly, ask the next question to the last person. Uh, does your seat? City or town? Hey, a subway. Nati. <laughs> Me. <laughs> You're very smart. Come on. Good. Oh, I was like, Shh. the best, the best thing. Does your city or town have a subway? Uh, well, depending. In some streets, they have like these big, strict holes that you can go under and up. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> you have these carcavas in some cases <laughs> that you can go down and up. It looks like a subway, but no, we don't. No, uh, in this case, it would be no, in capital, no, it, it doesn't. doesn't. No, it doesn't, okay? Because, no, here we have, we used to have this, uh, what is what was the name of this thing? Ay, here in the center of San Salvador, the light blue buses. I don't remember the name. <laughs> ¿Cómo se llamaba lo que tenía? Citrams. We used to have Citrams. Oh my God, the Citrams. We used to have that, but now we don't have. Now we don't. We just have buses, buses, and more buses. Excellent. Let's go here, right? So we were talking about the different parts of the house that I hope you remember. And here I have the vocabulary of the objects in the house, right? Here we have armchairs, armchairs, que son los sillones, right? Armchairs. ¿Por qué se llaman armchairs? Because they have a place for you to put the arms. No, it has a place. Uh -huh. It has a place for you to put the arm, armchair. A normal chair doesn't have, right? This is a normal chair and it doesn't have a place for the arms, but an armchair it has a place for the arms. Look, and you can put your arms there. And they are a little bit more comfortable. And it says armchairs because you have two, right? You have two here. Now, let's continue. We have the stove. This is not the kitchen. The kitchen is the place. This one is called a stove, okay? Cocina. Cocina, okay, a stove. The table right, the table, the bookcase, where you put all your books, the dresser, it's a gavetero, dresser, the coffee table, that you use it for everything less than coffee, okay, ponemos de todo aquí, menos café, coffee table, chairs, a mirror, mirror, right, this is a mirror, where you see your beautiful face every day, the mirror, when you wake up and you go like, mm, good morning, beauty, you say, <laughs> in the mirror. The curtains, right? The curtains. The microwave oven. Microwave oven. The pictures, right? Lamps. A refrigerator. Refrigerator. Sofa. sofa. The sofa. The rug, rug, television, rug, rug, rug. rug television, like a, alfombra. Alfombra. Oh. Yeah, rug. Desk, right? Desk, un escritorio, bed, and clock, right? Clock is the one that it's on your wall. The one that you have on your hand yeah. is watch. So don't say, oh, look at my watch. No, right? It's a clock. It's a clock, okay? So these are the different things that we have. Can you practice pronunciation with me? Armchairs. Armchairs. Arm Arm chair. Table. 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 Coffee table. Coffee, Coffee table. table. Bookcase. 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 Dresser. 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 Chairs. 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 Microwave oven. Microwave, microwave oven. oven. Microwave oven. Microwave, microwave oven. oven. Chairs. 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 Mirror. 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 Refrigerator. 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 Curtains. 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 Pictures. 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 Lamps. 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 Clock. 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 Bed. 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 Desk. 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 <laughs> Television. Television. TV. 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 Rug. 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 Right? Like a Rug. tiger. Rug. 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 Good. Rug. So, right now, where you are, the, hey, there's a, is that a chihuahua? <laughs> oh, my God. 
that at you. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. Things that you only listen in beginners too. It's like repeat sofa, refrigerator. Is that a chihuahua? <laughs> Okay. Cosas que pasan en la clase. Yeah. So sorry. No, but it's cool. I mean, no, you, you don't have to feel sorry about anything. Si de repente llegan niños, sus niños, su gato, su perro, perico. It's okay. I mean, it's okay. Yo les debería agradecer por darme un espacio en sus hogares, right? por darme entrada en cada una de sus casas. Okay. You are hitting my house, but I have a background here. That it's like for English corporativo. That's why you cannot see my house. But you are going to see a green screen anyway. So there is nothing much in a difference. Imagine that if I don't have this one, you see a green wall. <laughs> That's my house, a green wall, right? But I need to have this one as part of the classes, okay? I am going to change my clothes. I am going to leave it blue. Vamos a cambiar ropa, lo vamos a dejar azul. So that's pretty awesome. Okay. What of these objects do you have right now next to you? You can tell me, teacher, yes. here there is a sofa. There are curtains. There is a clock. There are pictures, right? There is for only one. There are for many. What objects do you have right now in your house next to you? There, there is, is a, a bed. There is a bed. <laughs> what, what do you have, Ana Beatriz? You were showing it. A, a chair. A chair, right? A chair. And you have the chair that you're moving. Right, a chair. Good. Uh, Jari, what do you have? There is my bed. Okay, my bed. There is a bed. What else? Is Isaias, what do you have? There is a refrigerator. 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 Very good. A refrigerator. Vanessa. There is computer. A computer. A computer. Computer. A computer. Roberto, what do you have? Sorry. I'm say with my with my job. I have. You have one good example right there at the back. Picture. Mac, I have a picture. Okay, there is a picture, right? A few of you need have that example. There is a picture. Good. Abdiel. The microphone, honey. Teacher have mirror. Ah, there is a mirror. There the, is a there mirror. is a mirror. Okay, good. Ana Beatriz. Oh, you told me the chair. Moises. What do you have? Um, ah, you have good exa a good example there. A, a clock. A clock, good. Fernando, what do you have there? There is a picture. There is a picture, good. Yes. Gustavo? I have a television as a computer screen. Okay, a television is a computer screen. So you yes. can see yourselves like in big screen, right? Yes. Ahí no ves en yes. Todo. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Marlon, what do you have there? A microphone. There is there is a bed. Oh, there is a bed. Okay, good. <laughs> Doris, what do you have there? There is a television. There is a television. Good. Uh, Elmer, what? Well, Elmer is it's on the car right now. What do you have around? There is a armchair. <laughs> there is an armchair. Kelly. There is this, a curtain. There is a curtain. Curtains. Ah, curtains. There are curtains. 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 Yolanda, what do you have there? Yolandita, hello. Calling Yolanda at once, calling Yolanda twice, calling Yolanda three times. Bingo, no Yolanda. <laughs> Doris, what do you have there? 
You told me that there's a TV, right? Okay, so let's continue. As I was explaining you, you use there is and there are to express things that you have next to you. For example, here, I am going to uh, share here in this conversation that we have. It says, this apartment, it's great. This apartment is great. Thanks. I love it, but I really need some furniture. Furniture is muebles in general, right? Furniture. What do you need? I need lots of things. There are some chairs in the kitchen. Okay, there are some chairs in the kitchen, but there isn't a table, right? There are some chairs in the kitchen, but there isn't a table. ¿Por qué ocupamos are con chairs y isn't con table? Who can give me the answer? There are some chairs in the kitchen. Porque son varias sillas. Varias sillas y para una mesa. Exactly, because the table is in singular. And it's negative. Okay, como no la tenemos, it's okay. isn't. And there is no sofa. Oh my God, wait. Okay, sorry. And there is no sofa here in the living room. In this case, you say there is no sofa. No tengo sofa. There is no sofa here in the living room. There aren't any chairs. And there aren't any chairs. There is only this lamp. Okay. <laughs> Let's go shopping next weekend. Okay. Uh -huh. Así pasa cuando se casa uno. <laughs> you don't have anything. It's like, well, we have uh, uh, the chairs, uh, the bed, and the TV. Ta da! <laughs> only that. <laughs> so there is and there are. It is good and it is useful for you to express how many things do you have, right? Hay un, hay una, right? When you say there are is for plural, there is is for singulars. Let's check on the next example that I have. Here, I have a little bit more explained about what I, I was mentioning. When you say there is a bed in the bedroom, it's affirmative, right? You have the bed. There is no sofa in the bedroom because you don't have any. And the next one that you have, there isn't a table in the kitchen, right? This is singulars, positive and negative. In these ones, you have plurals. There are some chairs. There are no chairs. There aren't any chairs in the living room. Tell me one thing that you have in your bedroom and one thing that you don't have in your bedroom. I have a lamp. Uh -huh. There is a lamp. And I don't have television. There, okay. There is a lamp, but there is no television. Roberto? Hi, teacher. Uh, I I don't uh, understand when I need to use isn't and aren't. Okay, isn't is for one thing. Si solo vamos a hablar de una sola cosa, isn't. There isn't. Porque aquí tenemos un singular. Si aquí fuera tables, con ese, tendríamos que ocupar aren't. aren't. ¿Por qué? Pero lo vamos a ocupar cuando no tengamos el objeto. For example, Aquí en el estudio donde estoy, eh, there is a TV, there is a TV, but there aren't any chairs, no. only one. There is a TV, but there aren't any chairs. Ok, tengo una tele, pero no tengo sillas. Ok, solo tengo sí, solo tengo una. There is only one chair, that is the one that I use. So, to talk about things, to talk about objects, I can tell you, there is a marker right here, but there aren't any notebooks. Okay, tengo un marcador, pero no tengo but I don't have an, any notebook. 
but there aren't any notebooks. So this is for singulars and this is for plurals. Okay, ¿qué es lo que va a ser singular? El objeto del que estás hablando. Okay, you say there is a bed, sí, hay una cama, pero no hay qué? Un sofá. Un sofá. Y no hay tampoco? Una mesa en la cocina. Una mesa. Okay, the most common form that you use is this one. There isn't a. You can say there's no sofa. But this is not very common. Esta forma para decir, there's no sofa, puede ser utilizada, pero no es muy común. La más común es decir, there isn't a table, there isn't a chair, there isn't a refrigerator, there isn't a mirror. Okay, it's, it's easier. And in this one that you say, there are some chairs or there aren't any. ¿Qué significa any? Ninguna. Okay, there aren't any. Y any lo vamos a ocupar, en este caso, con los plurales. There in isn't negative. a table, uh -huh, in negative, and there aren't any chairs. Okay, so that's the form that we do. And we are going to work on more exercise similar to these ones in tomorrow's class. So I gave you the introduction for this because we are going to use this one for the last class of the week. Okay. Mañana lo que sí necesito es que vean muy bien todos los rooms de su casa porque vamos a trabajar en qué es lo que hay y qué es lo que no. Okay? So you're going Mañana. to use with yeah, tomorrow, yeah. The class is over, my god. The hour flew away, okay? Cuando me preguntan siempre, "Ey, pero te, tenés que dar una hora de clase." Es, son como 10 minutos, así se va. <laughs> La hora. So there is for singular, Mañana. there are for plural. Mañana, what? Mañana no era libre, no. Mañana es jueves. El partido. El <ríe> por el partido. <ríe> ¿Cómo? Mañana no hay clase. No, no, no. no. It's because, of, because of the game. Te lo no. cambiamos por el 15. <ríe> No, but the, the, my, my birthday is on the 15th. Hagamos la clase a las 7. Yeah, we can do it yeah. at 7 if you want. For me, there's no problem. Pero se tienen que poner todo de acuerdo. Y yo pido permiso. Okay. Yeah, but, okay. Uh, make, make an agreement and you tell me, okay? Make an agreement and you tell me. And I am going to ask for permission and I think there is no problem for me. Votación en WhatsApp. Uh, yeah, you can make a, a, a WhatsApp group there for you to evaluate, okay? But I am going to ask for permission. I think there is no problem. In my case, there is no problem. For me, it's okay. Yo no puedo, teacher. Ah, so Tengo clases de la universidad. Mm, so Fernando cannot oh, make. Oh, oh, <laughs> it. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> mañana, <laughs> mañana, mañana hay parcial, teacher. <laughs> okay, so no. Okay, talk about it and then discuss it. But I, I guess that it will be there. Or if not, you are going to have one eye in the class, one eye in the soccer game. <laughs> You're going to be like, mix oh. up. It's like, yes, teacher, that is like, God. Yeah, there are some God. <laughs> and you will go. Oh, Let's let's talk about that tomorrow, okay? So, uh, uh, discuss it, and I'm going to be pendant of it uh, in the WhatsApp group, or we can do it at 7:30, from 7:30 to 8:30. Ah, but Fernando has a class, so discuss <laughs> it and let me know, okay? So that's ah. going to be for tomorrow's class. Have a good night and Bye. sleep a lot. Bye, Bye. 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 Bye, everybody. Yes, 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 yes. Tell me, tell me. Eh, me puedo quedar con... Le quiero hacer una pregunta. Yes, go Al ahead. Al final de la clase. Yes, yes. <laughs> Hurry up because I have another class. Go ahead. Thank you. para <laughs> afuera. Bye, 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 bye. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Yes, Kelly, tell me. Eh, fíjese que yo estaba haciendo ya el examen, Ajá. pero hay una pregunta de una sesión que de verdad que ya me di por vencida y no sé cómo es. Ok, eh, send me the image of whatever you need help with. Send me the image 
of the exercise and I can help you. Okay, I am going to help you with that. Okay, <laughs> Kelly, send me the image. Don't worry. Whenever you have problems, siempre que tengan problemas, envíenmelo y yo les ayudo. Okay. Eh, yo se la iba a presentar. No, ahorita ya no tiene chance. It's because I have another class right now. Ay, perdón. Sorry, sorry. Ah, but if you have it, share it. Go ahead, go ahead, I, go ahead. Okay, perfecto. Ahí okay. le escribe entonces. Okay, thank you. Gracias, Thank Dios. you, bye-bye.